Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for Wednesday, January 17th. This is for all signs. We are just going to see whatever comes up for this day. Wisdom, wisdom, beautiful. So perhaps it is a day of gaining wisdom or using your wisdom in some way to get you through something. I feel like you guys have, um, perhaps you're being, being given some kind of answer from above, okay? I feel like you've come a really long ways. I see a lot of life experience here, okay? It's like your life experience is has gotten you very, very far, all right? And you still have some doubts. You still have some fears, but you are being urged to look at all you've learned. Look at how far you've come. Uh, your determination always pays off. All right. I see that you have a lot of strength, you have a lot of stamina, a lot of confidence, and you've been through a lot. Okay? When the wisdom card comes up, it means you've learned something. You've been through that you know so whoever is watching this has been had a a life of learning, okay? And they have gained a lot of wisdom through their previous life experiences even if you know, some of them were, you know, a hard lesson learned, all right? It feels like somebody may be looking up to you because you may have encountered something that they are now going through, okay? Somebody may be coming today, coming to you today to, to get some of your wisdom regarding a some trouble that's going on in their life. I, it feels like you might have an answer for them, okay? Somebody may be looking to you for the answers, okay? Um, yeah, because somebody's lacking the wisdom that you have, okay? That's, that's what I see. It's like somebody is probably coming to you because they're feeling down. They're feeling like they aren't going anywhere. You know, they need your help. I feel like somebody needs your help. They need to, you to hold their hand, perhaps. I think you are being sought after today for your gentle compassion somebody sees that you have this knowing that you know that you can help them through this whatever it is i feel like your life experiences have made you very successful and strong and somebody on the outside is seeing this and they may be seeking your guidance today The thinking man. Interesting. This is very intuitive. This is a very intuitive day. Okay? This is about being able to follow your intuition. Being able to just go with whatever comes. Alright? And that's what I see. It's like you know. You have this inner knowing about you. So rather, even if somebody doesn't come to you, if you have something that pops up in your life today and you're questioning it, this, this reading right here is telling me that you know the answer already. You have the answer within you. You've already learned it. You've already been through this before, whether it's in this lifetime or a past lifetime. You have been through this before, and you have the wisdom to get through it. It's like you are you have the answers within you. Whatever's going on, the answers are within you. Whether somebody comes to you or if it's your own question, that's what I see. I feel like, you know, 
you there's no confusion here I see a very day a day full of receiving messages that are clear and precise okay and I think these messages are being given to you from above and I think I started the reading out like this that I feel like the, the universe or the heavens or somebody or something is providing you insight today that is helping you along your path so really listen and look for the signs today I think that you may be seeing some signs along the way that will be giving you some answers to your questions um, and I think that you may have shut this off in the past maybe you haven't been listening and that's why this reading is coming out today because you maybe you have shut down your awareness and you're being called to open your eyes to open your third eye even Maybe it's really time to wake up and, and really pay attention to the signs and use your your inner guidance, your inner resources, your inner wisdom to get whatever to get through whatever you're struggling with. I feel like today is a day of um, being very comfortable with who you are. There's like a God given guidance here, and you are being called to trust it. Trust your inner guide. Listen to your inner guide. Remember to follow your own path and believe in yourself. Okay? It's a day of believing in your own gifts, believing in your own inner guide, and believing in yourself. Okay? That's what I see. Many of you may be thinking about deepening your practice in regards to spirituality. There's a lot of spirituality in this reading as far as today goes. This is for Wednesday, January 17th. It feels like you are receiving messages um, constantly. And the, the, the trick is to, to accept them and listen to them. Okay? Um, don't forget who you are. Don't discount the messages that you are getting. I feel like your intuition or the heavens, spirits, angels, whatever it is, is are giving you messages and you are being called to listen. All right? Really listen to whatever you're hearing. You are hearing these things for a reason. Your inner guide is trying to tell you something. Somebody is watching this and... And their spirits are coming to me right now to tell you that you have to follow your inner guide. You're not listening. You're ignoring it. You're hearing the truth of something. They're trying to tell you something and you are ignoring it. You're trying to overanalyze a situation rather than accepting it, rather than accepting the truth. In your gut, in your, in your soul, you know the answer. You know what's going on, but it feels like you have these doubts. You're doubting yourself. You're doubting your intuition, and I'm here to tell you not to doubt your intuition. This is a day of following your gut. I'm telling you what. That is what it is. You have been doubting your intuition, and I really, I know that I'm repeating myself, but somebody, they're telling me that you need to listen. You're not listening. You're not listening. You're in denial over something. This is the equivalent of the Hierophant card, okay? I feel like you guys have been seeking guidance and you've been getting the guidance, but you haven't been listening to the guidance. You really, and this is about intuition, this is about intuition, this is about doubt, and this is about doubt with it being reversed. You are doubting your thoughts, you're doubting your gut, you're doubting your intuition, and I don't know who this is for. Somebody is, and I have the, I have the chills right now and the goosebumps. Somebody really needs to listen to their inner guide that is watching this. We're going to get you an Angel Romance card. I don't know why I picked this deck. I was going to use a different deck, but my hands went to this one. This must have to do with romance. I don't know why. I typically don't use the romance deck for the daily daily uh, vibes. For some reason, I was called to use this deck. Keep that in mind. I followed my intuition just like that, and that's what you are being called to do. Go with your instinct. Go with your thoughts. Listen. Stop doubting them.
January 17th, 2017. What do you have? What do you have for the daily vibes for these people? <laughs> you ready for it? New love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Now this doesn't mean that if you're coupled and you're in a happy relationship that a new person is going to come into your life. This could be a reconciliation. This could be a re, um, resurgence in a relationship. You know, it could be uh, a renewal of love. A new found feeling, a new beginning in love, okay? If you are single, a new love could be in sight, but you're ignoring it. You're not seeing it. You're not paying attention to the signs. You know, this card can also signify that there's a new man coming into your life, okay? If this is a man watching this, you know, it could be a woman, but this usually typically states a new man could be coming into your life, Okay, so just keep that in mind, but you must pay attention to the signs. I'll tell you of who we might be dealing with here. You could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, a Taurus, or a Gemini. All right, I do need to tell you that <coughs> I feel like there's a new beginning in love, whether you are single or coupled. It's like a fresh start in love, okay? But you have to really, really pay attention to the signs. Okay, this is more a day of following your intuition. The, the heavens above have brought this message to you because you haven't been listening to your intuition. You have been doubting yourself and you are being called to listen and look for the signs and stop doubting yourself. Namaste.